Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So I have bought a pickling kit from Heinz during Christmas and I finally got around to making them and I'm really excited to finally be trying them out. They're gonna be in sweet, garlic, and in spicy. I'm a pickle lover and so when I saw they had this kit where you can make your own pickles at home, I was like, I gotta try it. I did pick it up at Big Lots. This is how much it was there. I don't know if this is how much it runs everywhere else. So this is the container, that the kit that it comes with and you can make three different flavors, garlic, sweet, and spicy. It includes three spice blend packets, recipes, and tips. You need some mini cucumbers cucumbers, water, and some white vinegar, and some sugar. Now let's get started. So I'm gonna pop this open. Let's open this up. Y'all don't mind my nails. So this is what comes inside this little cute pickle box. Then these are the recipes the spicy, the garlic, and the sweet pickles. And these are the spice packets. Let's start with the spicy ones. You will need two pounds of pickling cucumbers, me preferred two cups of water and two cups of white vinegar. So I've just put two cups of water, two cups of vinegar, and the spicy seasoning packet. I'm gonna bring it to a boil and then we're gonna simmer it and then we're gonna pour it over the cucumbers. In the meantime, I'm gonna slice up the cucumbers while this comes to a boil. I'm gonna cut these like this. Just to cut them, thinly slice them. So I'm gonna cut them like in spear form, like this. Let me cut off these ends. Just like this. So you need two pounds of cucumbers. I thought for the whole thing, but I ended up going with two bags, which made, I have a total of four pounds of cucumbers, and that came out to about 11 cucumbers. So I'm gonna do four of two flavors each, and then three of another flavor. But because I'm cutting them in spears, it's gonna make more, so. So I just chopped up four cucumbers and I cut them into spears. So once I've cut up the spears, I'm gonna place them, it says to place them in the container like this. This is what the mixture looks like now. It's pretty pungent. It definitely, if you put your face to it, you can definitely get a whiff of that vinegar. All right, now I'm going to pour it into the container. Like marinate them in there and then we're gonna cover them and then we're gonna set aside here I have the mixture for the sweet pickles I have vinegar water half a cup of sugar and the seasoning packet for the sweet pickles I'm gonna let that do its magic and then we'll pour it into the cucumbers I just chopped up the second batch for the sweet pickles I don't have another container, but I do have these food prep containers, so I'm thinking they should work just the same. So this is where I'm gonna place them. And since they're small, they do fit in here. I mean, we'll make it work. And this is what they're looking like. One's gonna be for the sweet, one's gonna be for the garlic. The sweet mixture is ready, so I'm gonna pour it over. Here is the final mixture I'm waiting on. This is the garlic. And the garlic one is ready. I'm going to pour that over the cucumbers. Just like this. I'm gonna close this up. I've marked it with garlic and sweet and the bigger one is the spicy. I'm gonna place them into the refrigerator and it says to leave them in there for at least 24 hours in this container i do have spicy 
and this one I put garlic and then this one I put sweet I can't wait to pop them open it smells like pickles I'm so excited to try them out this is the spicy mm -hmm. it smells very pickly Look at it. those are the spices so these were the mini cucumbers and I just sliced them up into spears and yeah they look like pickles let's give this one a try the first one I'll be trying out is the spicy that's what it looks like it smells like a pickle mm. this is spicy it has a nice crunch to it at first I didn't think it was gonna taste spicy but it's got a slight kick to it mm-hmm really good and sour this is the garlic as you can see it's got the garlic in there so this is the second one this is the garlic it smells garlicky all right let me give this one back sour mm -hmm. oh i feel like this one is very sour more sour than the other one we can definitely taste the garlic in there, but it's not so pronounced. If anything, it tastes like a very sour pickle, but not too much like garlic. Just a hint of garlic in there. This one's good, and it's got a nice crunch to it too. And last but not least, here is the sweet ones. See, you can see the spices. Last but not least, here is the sweet flavored pickle. Smells like a hint of sweetness. This one's sweet. It's slightly tart. It's not too sweet. It's not sour like the garlic. I like my own. It's good. It's perfectly sweetened. It's not overly sweet. Or it's not overly sour. This one's good. Alright, y'all. So if you ever get a chance to make the Heinz pickling kit, I definitely recommend. Um I didn't know making pickles was so easy. I'm sure you can, now thinking about it, you can make your own blend and make your own type of pickles, which now inspired me to kind of make my own little concoction of spices to make my own flavor pickles. But this was actually really good. I think out of the three was this one, the spicy. It had a nice kick to it, a nice spice to it. And I think my second favorite was probably the garlic and then the sweet one. I give this pickling kit five out of five all of them were good they all tasted like they were supposed to so i'm gonna rate them all five out of five but my most favorite was the spicy one so i'm gonna finish up my pickles i want to thank you so much for watching go show me some love comment like and subscribe and i'll catch you in the next one bye